Hi everyone, thanks once again for tuning into Smash Factor TV. Today we're going to have a look at helping you swing much more from the inside. We're going to stop that out to in swing path, stop you coming over the top with a really simple and straightforward range drill that will give you loads of feedback. Let's go and have a look at some more game changing golf coaching. <laughs> Hi everyone and thanks once again for tuning in to Smash Factor TV. My name's Natalie Adams. With today's quick video tip, I'm gonna help you to improve your approach uh, into impact and get you swinging much more from the inside. We wanna stop that over the top uh, and steep downswing, just get you a little bit shallower and get you swinging more from the inside. So this is a great drill you can do on the range and to give you some feedback. So if you're hitting off grass, you can just do this by pushing uh, an alignment pole. So you can see here I've got uh, an alignment pole uh, to show us the target line. You could just lift that up and then push it into the ground at that angle. Okay, so it's just above the ball. If you're hitting on the range, we need to work on having the range basket in because obviously we need uh, something to put that alignment pole into. And then you can either push uh, the alignment pole into the basket that way just to elevate the uh, target line, if you like, to show you where the inside and the outside is. Or if you're not feeling too confident with that, just put um, a smaller alignment pole, just push a piece of foam onto the end of it and do exactly the same thing there. And please remember to hit the subscribe button and click notifications. We release two videos every week. They're all geared up to help you get better at golf and to enjoy the game more when you're next out on that golf course. What it's going to help us with is if we set up to the ball now, we're just going to check that that ball is directly under that alignment pole. So if I just bring that alignment pole in, there we go, we've got the ball directly under it. We've got the uh, ball at the edge of the alignment pole here so that when I uh, set up and I go to swing back, I'm not gonna hit that basket, so I'm not too close to it. You can push this as far out as you want to, but what it's gonna help us with is when we get to the top, well, first of all, it's gonna help us with our takeaway because if you're someone that takes the club away slightly on the outside you'd now hit the pole as you take the club away so we're going to make a better rotation round we're not going to hit that pole we're not going to hit that basket and then when we get to the top if you're coming over the top getting a little bit on the outside you're going to hit that alignment pole and it'll give you the feedback that you're not in the right position. So make a few practice swings, just get used to maybe just making some half swings, swinging back to here, turning the body back in, but learning how to not hit that alignment pole as you swing back in. And as you start to feel more confident, just make the swing a little bit bigger um, and it'll give you the feedback as to whether you were on the outside or more on the inside, which is what we want. You can then just concentrate on making that club face, come back to the golf ball from not hitting that pole from the inside of that pole with the face more towards that target line. Uh, and then you're gonna hit a much straighter golf shot. So make a few practice swings, get used to not hitting that pole. And then when you're feeling more confident with it, make a full swing and it'll give you the information that you need. So you know that you're hitting from the inside of that pole, you're able to rotate your body through as you move through impact, but great feedback drill for you, something you can set up really quickly on the practice ground um, to get that club head approaching the ball from a much better angle and to stop that over the top move and swinging from the outside to the in. Have a go at that the next time you're on the range, you should start to hit the ball a lot better once you've got used to it. It's another game changing golf tip. Oh, <laughs> oh,